Brew Crew. It's Ken from Craft Brew Morphology coming to you today with a clutch cutting and an update on that clutch. Uh, as always, support US Arc. I am a bronze member. They fight for your rights as reptile keepers. And if you're shipping reptiles for the first time, use Redline sh Shipping code ROBIN60 for 60% off your first two shipments. All right, so let's get into it. Uh, first part of the video is the clutch cutting. Uh, the pairing was a Bumblebee Spark and a Highway. Uh, the Bumblebee Spark laid for me last year. I think it was six eggs, but none of them were viable. Uh, so as we, I changed it up, paired the Highway mail to her, uh, and got four eggs, but they were four uh, nice big eggs. So I was really excited about that. So now on to the clutch cutting. Here goes the first egg. It's hard for me to tell what this one is. It may be, a, I mean, it's obviously a gravel or yellow belly based on the pairing, but it's really hard for me to tell what else is going on there. The news is that one is alive. Moving around. Or this or maybe maybe took the spider judging by the reduced pattern I mean, it doesn't look like a bubble bee, so maybe it's just yellow belly or gravel and the spider it's unfortunate but we shall see when it comes out and then the, the, in the pairing there was a highway so everything has to be yellow belly or gravel gravel and mom was a spark so we didn't pumas or bypasses okay this looks promising all right this looks like we hit uh Bypass or Puma, it's really hard to tell. This is pretty cool. Um, sweet. I don't know if you can see, it's moving around quite a bit in there. I mean, everything's alive, which is nice. But I, you know, wanted to hit that. That's cool. All right, and here's the last one. All right, hopefully we get another one. Was a little more gooey. Alright, looks like we hit another one of those. Um, it's hard to tell. Um, maybe another Puma or Bypass based on what I'm seeing here. Or it could be a a bumblebee 
with gravel or yellow belly. We'll see. Here's just the, the gravel, what I'm assuming is just gravel or yellow belly. Again, not the best, um, but you know, always possible. You know, no normals in this clutch, so that's great. Um, there's like two. This one, um, probably gonna be a spider yellow belly or gravel. one here I'm most excited about um, if you can see based on the pattern it looks like it's a, you know that bypass or kuma maybe with some other stuff uh, we'll see when it comes out um, it looks like uh, this one here is a bumblebee with no gravel or yellow belly since it has to be there. All right, let's go check them out in the light box now that you know they're out and they've shed and I have a better idea of what they are. All right, here's the first one. It's a male, yellow belly or gravel. I'm, I'm not gonna shed test them. Um, he's gonna be on my table at the Gettysburg show in November. Um, yeah, it look, looks pretty cool. He was one of the first ones out of the egg and one of the first ones to, to eat on his own. He's quite active in the light box. All right, here is the second one. I sexed this one a few times. I believe it to be a female. It is a spider, yellow belly, or gravel. And again, I'm not going to shed test this one because it will be for sale. Likely at a very good price because um, I want to move out of spider and... Hopefully she can go somewhere as a good pet. Okay, here's the third one. It is a female. It also has spider, unfortunately. This one was the runt of the litter, so I don't really know what's going to happen with her. Um, she's currently being assist fed, uh, but has taken two meals, uh, hasn't wrapped them up yet. Um, so we'll see. Um, this one's definitely, in my opinion, going to be pet only, uh, even though she does have some nice genetics at least for you know a combo that i i haven't seen and i think only one was sold on morph market um but yeah this is what i believe to be a spider bypass and it's a spider gravel and spark so i mean it's pretty cool acts like super animal unfortunately with the genetics being small um as you can see she does have a smaller eye so you know i'm not really sure what to do with this one um she might end up just staying here as a pet for me. Okay, here's the last hatchling from that clutch. Uh, unfortunately, she's right about to start her shed cycle, so she doesn't look um, as good as she, she normally would. So I'll, I'll link a video to a short that I put up uh, with her in it uh, to this video up in the corner. So if you want to see what she looks like, go uh, check that out after you watch this video. Or head over to my page and go find one of the, the shorts with her on it. Um, she's much more um, whiter and has this uh, nice contrast that you can see. Here it's sort of muted because she's about to go into shed, um, but this is what I believe to be a pastel bypass, so that is pastel, gravel, and smart spark. So that's pretty cool that, you know, this is an animal that I was looking to hit, uh, you know, with the pairing. Uh, so I'm, I'm happy that I hit it. Uh, currently she is going to be a holdback, but we'll see how things go as projects move forward. But I, I do like that it is gravel and spark, um, you know, to my knowledge, uh, just based on, you know, looking at similar animals on morph market and, you know, um, I don't think that it is a puma, but it could be. <laughs> um, you know, I, I, I don't think I'm going to shed test her either. I, I don't know. Maybe if, if she remains a holdback, I will. Um, but either way, she's a nice looking thing. All right, that's it for me today. Remember to like, comment, share, subscribe. I'll see you next time when I cut uh, and show the updates for Clutch 4. Unfortunately, cut Clutch 3 um, didn't last too long in the incubator and it wasn't viable. But, you know, 
it is what it is it happens so the next video will be uh my cutting your clutch four and the update on those babies um and i know these are a little bit after the fact at least this one is uh the other one i just just cut and they came out recently the day i'm filmed a couple days before i'm filming this so trying to get back on schedule to doing these videos and providing more updates via this format but anyway thanks for watching remember to like comment share subscribe we'll see you next time mm -hmm.